Hello everybody, welcome back to justlabla.com. Here in this video, I'm going to discuss with you how to send beautiful HTML emails using a package called Beautymail, which allows us to send uh, uh, clean and beautiful HTML emails. However, in my previous tutorial, I have said you about how to send emails using SendGrid, that is an email service provider. SendGrid is an email service provider, so we have to register there. I get a credential account so that we will send all those. That is how to send an email. Now here will in this uh, in this application we will uh, use some different templates which are provided by this package called Beautymail. We'll use this template and um, and which allows us to send beautiful HTML emails. So if you search for SendGrid here uh, in my website, uh, you will find these results here. You can go, you can click this and you can search about it. So here is the link to register to SendGrid and get those credentials from SendGrid and all. Here in this tutorial, I have said about, I have said about all those. So now we will uh, mainly concentrate on sending emails, sending beautiful emails. So let's get started. So I will fire up my terminal. So I will create a new application using this command laravel new and I will name this as beauty mails. So our application gets created. So we'll go into this folder now and now run composer update or composer insta. So finally our composer got updated. So now we also need to generate a key now otherwise it uh, when we run up uh, when we run it shows an error. So this generates as a key. Now we will run php artisan serve. So it just uh, Starts an app starts an application for us. I will just go to log eight thousand. So it um, will run an application for us. Meanwhile, I will open Sublime Text Editor to get my project here. Open folder. So before writing anything here, we'll just uh, install this package. This is the package here. First, we need to install it using Composer. Yeah, yeah. This is the command for it. We'll go here stop our server and just paste the command here so it will install us this package for us so it's installing after it gets installed we need to copy this uh, service provider class and also paste this in this app.php file so when this gets finished we have to paste it there that would be here uh, config app.php here in the service providers we will add just one more service that is our custom service classes and we will just save it and we also have to publish these assets related to this uh, package so before that we have to wait for this to complete so finally it got installed so now we will uh, publish these assets using this command which we copied earlier and we will just paste it so it's ready we have pasted these assets are published so this beauty mail package also provides us with a config file which we can use to uh, use our custom um, which can use to have our settings here for we can use twitter facebook flickr uh, uh, accounts if we have i just don't have flickr so i will use these two and I will use as just Laravel uh, even for Facebook it's the same name and even for image I will use some custom image I will keep that in public folder so you can keep in public folder logo.png I will kept an image there so you can configure everything you can also set the width and height I will set um, actually this is used for the logo at the logo at the for the email that is um, in the email it will be the top so it will it just needs 100 into 100 that is enough uh, for the logo in the email so set the configuration successfully and you also need to set some um, uh, configurations here actually we are using sendgrid so i will use sendgrid.net the mail host will be sendgrid.net and it its port will be 587 and you have to um, provide your sendgrid username and password so after configuring this we are 
I do send our emails. Uh, so first, we like look at the routes file uh, and look at this web dot php. Uh, it has only one route called welcome. So we will use this view and create a basic uh, form where we can enter any uh, basic form where we can enter an email. Uh, if you if you can um, look at the demo here, also provided a demo of this project here. So if you look at the demo of the project here. We just have email form to enter an email and button which uh, triggers the function to send an email. So we'll write the um, we'll just write this basic view here. So I removed all the basic stuff in this file which Narval gives that is about its title and its links. So I just removed that and add just um, and added and I added this form which uh, has one input field. It has one input field for email and a button submit button of type uh, submit. So this is all for error validation. This is also for error where this for success message when it successfully send an email, we will also send a success message something like that. For this, we use this uh, and um, this HTML blade templating, and we also we are using a post method here. So we we'll must uh, so we must use this CSR field here, and we'll do this action to send mail. So we'll go to this and so we'll go to so we'll define a root for this send mail and that would be post so root and I will define a post root here that would be slash send mail and that controller action would be index controller actually I have not created it I will create it now I will just call the function as index we don't need many functions we just need one function so we can create a controller using simple php artisan command php artisan make uh, this make is a very good function we can make uh, controllers models and everything using this and I will name this as index controller so it creates as a new controller for us and it will be located here app HTTP index controller and we'll write a new public function called index so now if you go to this uh, documentation of this uh, beauty mail package so we need this this so this part to uh, we need this part to send mails using this package so we'll just copy this and we'll uh, customize it as we want so we got this and we'll use this uh, make snowfire beauty mail class uh, actually you need to import but um, so here we can uh, define uh, how our email should be sent what the content should be what content should it go what data it should send so here there are default templates here there is this one is called uh, default templates provided by this package this is minty pay this minty template and I think I'm going to use this arc which I have used in the example so I'll copy this, paste this here and save this as welcome.blade.php so as you see yes, extends, uh, this extends uh, some templates from its vendor folder when this is a basic template here this is a basic template, uh, this arc template provided so we can also customize this text whatever you want you can also add some more tags here not only this h4 and paragraph you can add in this uh, content here this one content start and content end this one content start and content end you can add as many contents as you want you, they can, you can also add some widgets here these are some uh, default widgets here you can also add some widgets you can also add some content tags here so it's up to you how to customize your email so I'm for now I'm just leaving it like that so in the index controller uh, we need to get this two address so that we could send the email to the uh, so that we could send email to the one who which entered here so we'll get this email so we also we already passed this request here and in this uh, and in this um, yeah and in this file we are also passing the post method and getting this input field email so now we'll get it get it here 
we'll just type it as to email equal to we'll just uh, name the variable as to email so we can we can get our um, email using this uh, input uh, input of input get and that um, field name I hope it's also email so we'll get the to email now and we'll send it here to email and John Smith so that's it I think um, we will send the email now and see what happens so let's boot up our server so now I'll send an email to myself so I click the send email button let's see what happens it says input not found actually we have to use this input we have to use this input we have to use it from facets eliminate support facets and input now I think um, our application works so perfect so we'll just go back and see and we'll enter an email here so hopefully it sends an email so actually we didn't return anything here so it uh, shows a blank page actually in the original application here I will set some validations also you cannot you cannot enter an empty field like this and when you send an email it returns back oh, so you cannot you can do all those you can also find this uh, application in github you can find the code and verify it there and you can do all those validations here uh, you can see here you can see here I've got an email here you can see here I've got an email here I've clicked this email uh, this email I've got actually I'm getting this uh, emails uh, because this mm, I'm getting these emails because they're broken actually the path is uh, need to be fixed and uh, by the way these are mere hello world this is a test and this is another example and rather than these are our custom text you can use in the template all this text is from here 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 you can you can also use something hello world uh, this is all the text, this is all the custom text actually if you see in my um, uh, this application I have sent uh, some um, I have added some um, some more things to the view you can see these resources use become.blader.php choose email so welcome.blader.php and you can see here I've added some table path and all I've added some table which allows us to uh, add some table TRTDs which uh, provides uh, links to some of my applications uh, in this uh, provide some links to some of my previous application in this uh, website so So you can here in this um, here you can also see there is a success matches which says email sent successfully and we need to we also need to get an email here so this is the email here so when I click this uh, you can see the image uh, here this is the image here and this is the heading custom heading I have kept and this is the text and if you can uh, pull this uh, into full screen and see this is the mail I got and this is the table I kept some some of the post here uh, these are the image fields links and all you can also see this um, Twitter and Facebook URLs these also work too yeah I can it will redirect to it will redirect to if it, uh, my Facebook page and Twitter pages so all the code is written here just a table with some TRTDs which uh, uh, where I have kept these uh, images links that's it uh, you can see this um, you can see so uh, that's basically it you can uh, do whatever you want with this template that's basically it you can um, customize this template as you want you can add this some more contents as I said 
and th that's how you send a basic uh, email using this uh, beauty mail package so thank you for watching if you like this video please comment subscribe to the channel and share it with your friends also please follow on my also please follow the astral.com and twitter facebook so guys thank you for watching stay tuned for next video